Alleged notorious serial killer Gracious David West, who sent shivers down the spine of the people of River State, has been arrested. In a viral video shared by the police, the suspect confessed to the crime. She didn't actually know that there was a knife there. So I brought her the knife. That threat her that I let her down shot. Then she shot that we used the knife on her. So with that fear, she couldn't shout. And by then the television the volume was loud. Yes, loud. So she kept quiet and after that I used the wrapper to tie her hands from the back. Then tie her legs. Which wrapper? Pillow This come a day after women trooped out in the numbers to stage a protest at the government house in Port Harcourt over the killing of eight women in hotels. According to the police, he was apprehended by operatives of the special anti-robbery squad who were on a stop and search operation. In the wake of the killings, social media went agog, with some people blaming the state governor, Yesom Wiki, for being silent on the matter. The 26-year-old suspect from Bugama local government area of River State, who is an alleged cultist, was nabbed along the east-west road en route to Uyo from Port Harcourt. The police revealed their information available to it shows that the suspect was on his way to a quiet bomb to continue with another round of killings. The closed-circuit television installed in a hotel where the accused serial killer David West committed another crime aided his arrest. Nigerians have suggested that CCTV should be installed in public places to forestall another occurrence. Conscious effort by citizens, CCTV installation and effective government policies are solutions outlined by a former commissioner of police turned security expert. The, the police and the DSS, they go to check the number of guests are in the hotel, identify who are who are you, where is your business, and so forth, to have their profile and so forth. That is being done. Also, I think uh, the hotel had to also himself to also be vigilant too. Be vigilant to see that when a guest comes to the hotel, they should know the kind of person, monitor the person, the kind of person, know, know his activity, the kind of person who visit him and so forth. Because that's a good consciousness that will go long ways in reducing crime and preventing crime. If you go to places like other, other even African countries, capital cities of, of African countries, even in even in the US and America, most of their cities, capital cities, the the crime rate is very high, very very high. But Abuja, Abuja, the crime rate is not as it's not it's not as it's, there's no crime free society. Understand? No crime free society. What the government does, that the small government do is that to control and minim bring the crime to a level terrible level. While Nigerians weigh the punishment melted out to the man who has allegedly killed women, citizens have been urged to make conscious efforts at preventing a reoccurrence. Roots TV, Nigeria.